Hi, I'm going to show you how to make this really cute flower out of material. I'm going to be using our chevron pattern today. I like to use a needle and some thread and today I've got our baker's twine. You just make big stitches about half inch doesn't have to be perfect you're gonna go through like that and I tied one end with a knot and I just made this whole strip here ended up looking like this so I can wrap it around an eighth inch dowel that's about six inches long and I used our sticky strip I placed, I don't know, about an inch, inch and a half at the end of the dowel or hand to grab the material. So I went all the way around, all the way the length almost the length of the material. You just wrap this around. <clears throat> You're gonna grab some more sticky strip. I just probably cut about two to two and a half inches. You're gonna wrap it around the bottom of it and we're gonna use the blossom punch to cut out a flower to hide the mess on the bottom. Just wrap it around the bottom. It doesn't have to look really pretty going to get covered up in the end. You can make your ruffles and everything, pick the best side later. Here's your blossom punch out of the Midnight Muse. I just cut down to the middle in between two petals, more sticky strip to hold it together. And then I brought it over to make this little cone flower. I trim just a little bit. When it makes the cone, flip it over and just cut off a bit. Don't cut too much. It'll, you can make it widen as much as you need to later. And I think I might need another little strip of sticky strip around the bottom of the flower of the material to grab it better. down in and you can trim everything up make it look cute and here you go it's really super cute really fast